Hello again, everybody. It's me, Marcus, and I review stuff. Today, I'm reviewing the song Letter to Madeline by Ian No, or Noe. I'm not, still not sure. Uh, but this song was chosen at random, so for those who don't know, I have taken all of my requests, put them into a Google Sheet, and I hit the randomize button three times. The top result is a song that I listen to next. So, this was the winner of the last randomizer, I guess you could say. Uh, this obviously does come as a request, since everything here is a request. Um, so, if you want to make a request, leave it in the comments. We'll be sure to get to it. Alright, let's listen. You know, I don't really know anything about Ian Noe, or Ian No, going in totally blind. Uh, I do understand that he's probably country, just based on uh, the few things that I have seen, but here we go. I mean, his album's literally called Between the Country, but whatever. Here we go. Looked like a hundred guns held on me Hunkered by the shed A Detroit general and company A calling boy come out We have you Jill Beside the buckshot door I stood still Wondering how the hell The bastards found me in those hills And clinging to a letter That I wished I'd mail Oh rest easy Had a lie I'm bringing down the pain Across this flooded County line And when I get home We'll have a grand old time But don't you shed no tears be surprised if you get the word that your wild man's up and died to set me up a stone on that high hillside. In the pouring snow, sad but swift. I headed down the highway Hoping that the burden of my blues would lift And praying that the whiskey would keep me brave Oh, but I got caught in the cold Looking like a hobo without no mercy from the road And feeling like a dead man without a grave Rest easy, had a lie I'm bringing down the pain Across this flooded county line And when I get home, we'll have a grand old time But don't you shed no tear Or be surprised If you get the word That your wild man's up and die Set me up a stone on that high hillside Oh my, oh my oh, Bloodied up and chained My legs pinned down I woke to find my fate in the hands of four men gathered around a cursing for the bad they knew I'd hear And the more they stomped and moaned the more I prayed feeling every spark flying off of that fire and the rusted blade said better think it through this is your last chance kid Rest easy, that a lie I'm bringing down the pain Across this flooded county line And when I get home, we'll have a grand old time but Don't you shed no tears Or be surprised If you get the word That your wild man's up and die Set me up a stone on that high hillside
Yeah, man, that was good. That was such like an easy, wonderful listen. Uh, really had this nice, like almost outlaw tone to it. You know what I mean? Uh, liked his voice. It was just a very great voice for country. I feel like um, really did the, the job. The job really did the song a, a solid here with having him on on the vocals here. Uh, yeah, guitar was great, drums was great, everything was great. I, I liked it a lot. I don't know why I'm just clicking between random tabs. I know you can see that, but <laughs> I liked it. This is what I'm looking for in my lyrics, which I know you can't see, but... Um, anyway, we're going to break the song down like we normally do, of course, starting with the lyrics. So here we are. Uh, looked like a hundred guns held on me, hunkered by the shed of Detroit General and Company. Calling, boy come out, we have you jailed. Beside the buckshot door, I stood still, wondering how the hell the bastards found me in those hill hills and clinging to a letter that I wish I'd mailed. So yeah, uh, this is why I had that outlaw sound. The lyrics very much lent themselves to that, right? Hundred guns held on me, hunkered by the shed of Detroit General and Company. This guy's on the run uh, from the law, I, I would imagine. He's got this letter in his hand, uh, presumably the letter to Madeline that he wished he had time to mail, but now it's too late, right? Go rest easy, Madeline. I'm bringing down the bank across this flooded county line. I think, uh, yeah. Uh, and, and and when I get home, we'll have a grand old time. I'm bringing down the bank across this flooded county line. Uh, to me, like, I read that as if he's robbing the, a bank, but I know that, that, like, a river has a bank, and he's talking about the flooded county line. So I'm not too sure, but I assume he's robbing a bank. And maybe he's speaking in code here, like... Uh, not a very good code, because, I mean, <laughs> if I understand it, then certainly, hopefully, somebody of the law would. Uh, and when I get home, we'll have a grand old time, but don't you shed no tears or be surprised if you get the word that your wild man has up and died. Just just set me up a stone on that high hillside. So there's a likeliness I'm not coming back, right? Um, so, now, in the pouring snow, sad but swift, I headed down the highway, hoping that the burden of my blues would lift. I'm praying that the whiskey would keep me brave. Oh, oh but I, I got caught in the cold, looking like a hobo without no mercy from the road, and feeling like a dead man without a grave. So yeah, this guy's roughing it. You know, it's it's cold. Uh, he, he's got no money. He's been probably just living out of his truck, right? Drinking whiskey, um, just trying to stay alive and trying to, I guess, pull off this job, perhaps. Go rest easy, Madeline. Um, bringing down the bank across this flooded county line, and when I get home, we'll have a grand old time. But don't you shed no tears or be surprised if if you get the word that your wild man has up and died. Just set me up a stone on that high hillside. Oh my, oh my. Bloodied up and chained, my legs pinned down. I woke to find my fate in the hands of four men gathered around. So he's been captured. Uh, and cursing for the bag they knew I'd hid. And the more they stomped and moaned, the more I prayed, feeling every spark flying off of that file and their trust and their rusted blade. Said, better think it through, this is your last chance, kid. To me, this doesn't sound like an officer, unless perhaps you know they take very brutal means. This maybe sounds like someone he stole from or someone he owes money to, right? Um, mm. So yeah, like he's been captured. These are probably his last moments. Um, oh, rest easy, Madeline. I'm bringing down the bank across this flooded county line. And when I get home, we'll have a grand old time. But don't you shed no tears or be surprised if you get the word that your wild man has up and died. Just set me up a stone on that high hillside. Yeah, you know, it's like, if I don't come back, you ain't getting my body either, right? So uh, it makes me think, again, it's maybe not law enforcement. It's, it's more so probably just uh, some gangsters or someone he owes money to, right? So... Uh, you're not getting the body back. You're just going to have to basically set up a stone out there to mark my grave, essentially. Um, so, yeah, fantastic song. Again, uh, the, the lyrics lent themselves to this really outlaw feeling to it. I liked it a whole lot. Two thumbs up lyrically. Um, I think as far as the instrumentation and the vocals go, one, I said he has a great voice for this kind of thing. I think he just, you felt sort of the sorrow, the, the, the feeling, the emotion in his voice, and I think that really did the song well. So that was really nice. Um... As far as the guitar goes, the guitar was fantastic and really gave it that outlaw feel, that almost sense of desperation and, and uh, also sort of romanticism. Like this is someone who has chosen this life and kind of knew what they were getting into and, and, and it sort of romanticizes it in a way while still keeping it sort of dark and uh, not necessarily a happy ending, right? So um, I, I think it worked really well, well here. All the instruments played well together. Uh, the vocals were great and it really gave you a sense of time and place, I think, in this song. So I give it two thumbs up there as well. 
And then as far as replay value goes, look, this one's on the playlist. It just had so much heart. It had so much feeling. I feel, you know, I, I felt that uh, when I was listening to it, it was just so easy to get lost in the story. I was kind of listening to the lyrics and just uh, jamming out with it and, and really appreciating what they were doing instrumentally as well. So just a lot of great things from this song. Very happy uh, with having listened to this one. So I give it two thumbs up across the board. This was a great one. Uh, so thank you for whoever requested this one. Let's get more like this. Uh, as always, if you would like to make a request, leave it in the comments. I'll be sure to get to it. If you enjoyed the music, go support the artist. Go listen to their music wherever you can. One place you should be able to find uh, some Ian No or Ian Noe. Still not sure of his name. I'll have to look that up before the next time I, I, I uh, listen to one of his songs. Um, is in my Spotify playlist. It's in the description below. It has every single song I've heard so far on my channel. And if you want to support me, it's all the normal stuff you do on YouTube. You know, like and subscribe and comment. All right, before I let you go, let's find out what we're listening to next. So going back to my list, let's get rid of this one. We have finished listening to it. Where is it? Delete row. All right, and we'll randomize three times. One, and two, and three. All right, looks like the next song we're listening to is Corey Brennan's Another Nightmare in America. So looking forward to that, uh, and I'll see you guys then. All right, hope you're staying safe and healthy. Peace out.